Each year, Vanderbilt University participates in the NASA Student Launch Competition. This year's competition required the construction of a series of autonomous ground support equipment that would allow us to retrieve a payload and place it into a rocket bay. Here you can see the Autonomous Ground Support Equipment, or AGSE. The AGSE begins by resetting itself to an initial position. This position is logged by the onboard controller. After reaching its initial position, the AGSC signals the rocket payload bay to open using a custom-built magnet-locked wire. The AGSC then begins to seek out the payload. It uses a series of short sweeps, analyzing the perceived images from a webcam. These images are filtered, thresholding out noise and detecting shapes and colors. When a contiguous set of colors and shapes appears, similar to the payload's description, the AGSC analyzes the image and centers itself over the top of what it perceives as the payload. This image and position are stored on the AGSC for later use. A signal is sent to the user interface panel that the payload has been found. With the payload found, the AGSC then seeks out the open payload bay. Fiducial markers are present on the inside of the carbon fiber plate that will house the payload. These markers provide a line along which the AGSC will eventually place the payload. The AGSC camera seeks out these fiducial markers. Upon recognizing the patterns, similar to a QR code, the AGSC is able to detect the payload. A signal is again sent to the user interface panel to indicate that the payload bay has been found. After finding both of these locations, the AGSC returns to the payload. It orients its custom gripper along the axis of the payload, slowly descending. The gripper claws are able to close around the payload and provide enough friction to maintain it. The AGSC rises and slowly rotates back around to position itself above the payload bay. Once it is above the position recorded as the payload bay, it again descends, and, positioned closely enough so as to avoid any damage upon landing, it releases the payload into the bay. A signal is sent to the payload bay to close, and the payload is secured inside the rocket body. The AGSE then swings itself out of the way to allow the rocket to be erected for launch.